Stay sprung, and I'm back with a very special period timepiece that was, and still is to this very day, a landmark model for Timex. And I'm speaking of the vintage Atlantis 100, which was released in 1987, and still 33 years later, just as legible and reliable as day one. Per the case code and printed on the back, which mine reads 40, this Atlantis was manufactured in November of 1988. The digital Atlantis sports an all stainless steel case, ending an era where Timex went pretty much base metal exclusively. The watch has a 40.5 millimeter case and comes in at 10.5 millimeters thick with a lug to lug width of 45 millimeters and an uncommon 19 millimeter band width. The Atlantis boasts a mineral crystal display plus a 100 meter resistance rating. The Atlantis being a sports slash tool watch has an array of complications and functions, including a day date calendar, lap or split divisions, 10 hour chronograph, second time zone, two alarms, both for the main time and the second time zone, hourly chime, 10 hour countdown timer, and an LED backlight. And after 30 some odd years of abuse, wear and tear, the durability factor is apparent. Although the white text spelling Atlantis 100, chrono, alarm, and timer, all printed on the bezel, has worn off over the years, other than this sign of aging, minus the dings and scratches from user error on my behalf, the Timex has held up very well. With the most notorious point of failure on the vintage Atlantis being the four screw down points of the plastic bezel. These tend to snap and break at the tabs, which mine hasn't. And I can honestly say, 30 years ago, I started my watch collection with this exact watch. And not only do I still own it, the piece is fully functional, from the light to the chimes and everything in between. Tasteful and classy for the tool watch that it is, the Atlantis has yet to outlive its design, which was proven by the re-release of the new Atlantis 100, which is built with much cheaper, lower grade parts, an all plastic case, no screw down case back, and less contrast on the display, which makes for lower legibility. The newer model does have an indigo light, so that's one upgrade. Overall, I must say the durability and quality of the vintage Atlantis is 100% undeniable. And to think I'm able to share with everyone where my love for watches and lifelong journey with watches began way back in 1988. And this also proves that a good quality timepiece, whether it be a quartz or automatic, will last a good lifetime and even have the ability to be passed down through generations. If you like the content, please subscribe, share, and hit the like button. Comment down below with your thoughts on the Atlantis by Timex. And oh yeah, stay sprung.